I just wrote a column for WorldNet Daily that'll be up today, worldnetdaily.com. I'll give a little advertisement for my friend Joseph Farah. But it's very interesting because a year ago, Donald Trump did not speak at CPAC. And I think he was worried that people were going to walk out. The leadership of CPAC was not supportive at that time. I think they were leaning towards Cruz in many ways. But he has now taken over the Republican Party. They have come to him. Everybody loves a winner. And I believe people can evolve over time. I believe that Donald Trump is basically a conservative at this point. And in many ways, he's more conservative than Ronald Reagan. Look at his cabinet. So I'm very, very uh, gratified to see that. And what I love about him is he's a street fighter. And in today's world, we need that. When you have vicious ultra leftists like Jeff Sucker at CNN, who he called the Clinton News Network, I call it now the Communist News Network, you need somebody that can fight back. You need somebody who's not afraid. And the more they push at him, the more he pushes back. And that's what we need today. So I'm really happy that he's president of the United States. And I want to support him in any way I can, personally. And as far as Freedom Watch is concerned, which I founded after Judicial Watch, we're nonpartisan, but I want to see him succeed. So we have formed a leftist media strike force. You can find that at leftistmediastrikeforce.org. Uh, we are taking action against the leftist media when they lie and do things like they did a day before the inauguration. CNN ran a piece on Wolf Blitzer's show suggesting how you could assassinate Trump. It was unbelievable. Uh, and others. You know, today CNN, it was revealed uh, Matt Lauer uh, was behind a lot of the stuff that went on there that's, that's not right, you know, on the Today Show. So we're taking action basically to give this administration a chance to succeed. We don't work for it, but we're kind of in parallel. And we can do things that President Trump can't for political reasons. Uh, he can't sue Jeff Zucker. We can. Uh, we filed an FCC complaint last week for that assassination suggestion. So uh, I'm really happy, and uh, I thought his speech today was great, and Vice President Pence's uh, was very moving yesterday. You could see him even tearing over a little bit on that. And I'm not one that goes lockstep with politicians. You know that. Uh, but I'm happy with what's going on right now. I want to see them succeed for the benefit of the country.